okay in this video we're going to talk about assignment of the contributor rights we're going to talk about the structure of a contract the reason we're going to talk about this is because i want you to get a clear idea how the structure is when you have a clear idea how the structure is it's easy for you to find certain articles it's also easy for you to understand how the contract works when something happened and why certain information is important so we're going to talk about the structure so you can get a general idea how it works let's go to the drawing board so as you can see this is a drawing board and like i said it's important to understand how the structure works so we're going to talk about it the structure of a contract is always like this you have the contract itself you have the intro the body part and you have the outro that's technically how it works so we have the intro the body and the outro so most people don't realize this the intro it's really important but technically you put two things in the intro here the intro you put the names of the parties yeah and the address and all those stuff and you pay you you put here why do you go into an agreement what's the reason why you create the agreement and if you don't put that it's going to be difficult and why is this important imagine when something happened and you didn't make any appointment or any agreement in a contract then most of the time the law will say hey in that situation you need to look at this why did you create the agree agreement and what's the goal of the agreement so that's why this is really important i'm not saying the other part of the contract is not important what i'm saying is this is really important the thing is your name and the address is also important because most of the time when i see people they sign a contract online you just see their name you don't see their um, address or whatever and that can be a problem so it's important to put your address name because you need to identify who's the party of the contract and it has to be clear so if you look at the body in the body you put the con the agreements the things that you agree upon it can be anything but just make sure that everything you agree upon it's in line with the law that's in your area so keep that in mind and then you have the outro the outro is also important but there is something in between these it depends what kind of contract you have but this one you also have it it says it talk about the govern law and this is really important because when you talk about the government law, you decide which law of which country or which um, judge of this country apply to this contract between you and the other person. If you're in the same country, it shouldn't be a problem. But if you're in a different country, you need to decide which one you're going to choose. Some people are easy about it. Some people will be like, hmm, yeah. So this is really important because when something goes wrong, you need to go to, the, um, to that country and fix it in that country. And it can be expensive but if it's in your own country you know how it works so it can be less expensive those costs are less that's something you need to keep in mind but technically every contract when you use this you need to have an intro make sure the information are really important make sure that the body you have exactly what you're going to agree upon about the payment or what you're going to get make sure it's really in there and then the outro make sure the government law you talk about it and also make sure that both parties sign it so this information about the name of party a and b if you have between three people c yeah, that those match here because it's really important when they sign that's something you need to keep in mind so if you have question about it what you can do is just go in the discord you find the link in the description Go to the channel, text us. In the channel, text us. You can text us and then ask us question about this directly. And we will try to help you as soon as possible. And if you're new to this channel and you like this kind of content, seriously, subscribe. It's for free. Seriously, subscribe. If you like this video, like it. If you dislike it, dislike it. I really appreciate it if you do one of those, both. Yeah. I hope you guys like this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye.